guys welcome back to my channel my name is stephanie lee and it's definitely been a while it's been like three years since i made a video on this channel so this is quite a scary thing for me but the video that i'm doing today is a get ready with me because the past couple of videos i've made or i've tried to make has just been me sitting down and talking so i thought why not make a video where i'm doing something so it's interesting but also, I can speak. Yeah, this is what this video is. Don't worry, I'm already, I'm already been make up and done. I just want to warn you because, um, obviously this is my first video in a long time, so the lighting isn't gonna be very good. But it's fine. We'll move. I'll figure it out someday. And yeah. So, anyways, enjoy the video, guys. Um, definitely consider subscribing if you like the video. If you watch the end and like and comment <laughs> i don't really know what else to say so yeah enjoy the video oh jump scare warning by the way hey guys welcome back to my channel today we will be doing a get ready with me um and i only have like 45 minutes to get ready which is which is long enough like it's a long long amount of time but realistically speaking, I only have half an hour because I have to get to work. So if you cannot tell, I have no makeup on right now. Um, I just did my skincare, I just got out of the shower, so my hair's a bit of a mess. So I think first things first, I need to like sort my hair out. For work, I have it like up. Sometimes I have it slicked back. But it just depends on how greasy it is. Because sometimes it can handle having the bits out in the front, but sometimes it can't because it looks disgusting. So I'm a big bottle of um, shampoo. So I'm a little bit ill. Yeah, I don't know why. I don't know how, but I am. And it kind of sucks. My throat just hurts. Like, I don't actually feel ill. You know when you get, like, that little feeling before you get a cold? That's what I feel right now. Throat hurts so badly. So I'm just going to have to see if it worsens during school. Because of it's usually if I'm at school and I have a cold, it gets worse. So we're just going to have to see. But I'm washing my hair tonight, so which is why it's like greasy. Because I wash my hair every three to four days. I usually do it on a Wednesday if it's a school week, and then a Sunday. That's what I'm gonna do for my hair at the moment because I know I can just either slick it back or put it up somehow. My face looks really oily. I swear it's literally just because I've got out of the shower and I've done my skincare. I'm also I tried to film one of these yesterday. And I literally was filming for like 40 minutes. So I'm going to try and be quicker this time. The reason why I'm filming this one is because the other one I didn't like. So yeah, but I'm going to start with some contour. Like I always realize when I'm talking to the camera, I switch topics so fast that I just cannot keep up with myself. Like I realized when I was editing it yesterday, I was just like, I'm not like, I don't finish any of my stories I'm telling. So I think I need to get a bit better at it. So I'm going to try and not move as quickly this time because when I feel like I'm rushing, that's when I start just chatting out my ass. Now, realistically, I'm not the best makeup artist in the world. I'm really not. I'm like the opposite. Makeup is like just, it's not something that I do. Like it's something that I do. I've been doing a lot like over the past like two years but before then I didn't really wear it. I wore mascara and that was probably the extent of my makeup from like year 7 to year 9 and then when I got to year 10 I like did contour and I did like a little bit of highlighter and then year 11 I did a bit of like concealer but not a lot because my face, I don't know if you can see, my face is quite red. It's quite red all the time. So when I didn't wear any actual makeup, my face would just always be red. And I hated it because like I got picked on in class and then I would go red. Like I would literally look like a tomato. Yeah, it wasn't fun. So then I started wearing concealer and stuff but because when I wear a concealer, if I don't put it all over my face, it's so noticeable that I put concealer here because you can see it on my face, which is why I found a skin tint or like a tinted moisturizer which i can't i put on like foundation you probably shouldn't but i like it because i feel like it applies it evenly and with this because it's not heavy it's not a heavy makeup i can literally just like i don't feel like it's on my face which i love because i hate i hate the feeling of foundation on my face 
because when I was a dancer, the amount of makeup you would have to wear was insane. It's like a full beat, crazy, crazy makeup. Like a foundation that's darker than your like actual shade. And then you're doing red lipstick, smoky eye, false eyelashes. You're doing a big amount of makeup. Oh my god, guys, let me tell you about this. This um, mascara, it's called a mascara primer. It's called Doc Doctor Mascara Fixer. It is so good. It's like a long lash one, or this is the volume one, and then there's a long lash one. Because I have pretty long-ish lashes already, I tend to just do the volume one instead of the long lash one. But essentially, this is basically like glue for your eyelashes. Just put it on like this like how you would with normal mascara. With this, I have a dried mascara, and then I have, they're both the same mascara, but this one's old and this one's new. This one, I literally just, just kind of messing around with my lash so that they become a little bit more noticeable. You can see the ends a little bit more. Put it on. What I like to do is I keep it on the ends, because I find that if I put it too much on the bottom of my lash, it just makes my eyes look smaller. And then on my inner corners, I use just like the tip and I just kind of go like that. And then, boom. I actually did a pretty good job of not getting any of that on my eyelid apart from like a little bit. Now I'm gonna do like my eyebrows whilst I'm waiting for this eyelash to dry. So I really struggled to look at myself, especially when I like do my makeup because I feel like when you're doing your makeup, you know, you're very content with the way that your face looks. As my first kind of appearance on YouTube, being barefaced, it's like a lot. Anyways, um, I don't know if you guys knew, but I made videos before. I've made five videos before um, on this YouTube channel. Um, two of them were hypnosis. Back then, there's so much research about everything to do with YouTube. I did so much research. I, I loved it and I enjoyed making the videos and obviously they talk about like a niche that you have to have you have to have some sort of thing it doesn't have to be a small topic but some sort of thing that that's what your channel does so whether it's like day in the life vlogs get ready with me's you're a lifestyle influencer or and I wanted mine to kind of be like a lifestyle influencer kind of not really though I don't really know what I was going for and then someone kind of commented on my video and was like, oh, you should like react to my hypnosis video. Do whatever, react to hypnosis. And I was like, say less, that's all kind of fun. So I did it. It was kind of fun, but, and then I made like two of those videos. It was kind of fun. And then I think I lost motivation and didn't post on YouTube for like ages. That is not where I want my niche to be. So I'm very sorry if you guys came to this video thinking it was going to be like a hypnosis video. <laughs> Because I don't, I don't really want to do any of those anymore. Just because I don't find them fun anymore. I kind of want to move on from that. So I want to start like a little, a fresh, a fresh new, new start to YouTube. Um, I apologize if my editing is bad. I apologize again if the lighting or the angle angles and stuff is bad i promise you i'll get better at this i want to like study a bit more on youtube and just get a bit, bit more of a grasp on what i need to do to kind of keep you guys entertained because i do want to start getting back into this um and also oh my god we had a we like were laughing so hard we went to my friend's house at lunch one time it was literally this week as well and you know like the when there was like a little trend on TikTok a while ago where people would like make like a and then they would smile. I can't do it. I'm not gonna fucking embarrass myself like that. But they like they like shush the babies, but they do like a really creepy like shush and then like smile and their lips are like weird. My friend did that the other day and it was the creepiest thing. And now it's our group chat background and it is so scary. I literally, I keep on forgetting that that's our um, background, so when I open it, say in front of people that aren't in the group chat or whatever, they see that picture and they're like, what the fuck is that? I've got 15 minutes. I really hope it's not busy today at work. I hate busy days. 
Oh my god, you should have seen last week. Last week it was Mother's Day on the Sunday, and Sunday is always the busiest day for my for my work. And um, they were so busy, literally full bookings every single setting. And to be fair, because they were all so prepared with everything, um, it wasn't actually difficult. It literally wasn't difficult whatsoever but and i had my friends there with me as well and bless bless her little corn socks and my friends um that was like her trial shift and it was crazy but to be fair I, she was supposed to stick with me and then the manager like whipped her off and was like we're gonna go polish some glasses so poor her was like stuck in the fucking bar polishing glasses bless her this is pretty much my look for today um you know, I say not a lot has gone on, and it doesn't really look like a lot of effort has gone into this, but trust me, a lot of effort has gone into this. Um, I'm going to start doing my freckles a bit more, just because I feel like they give me a bit more of like a, like a sun-kissed type of beat. But this is the full little makeup look. I love when that happens. Um, oh hey hey let's not do that how about how about let's not fall off my fucking stand please let's not do that yeah anyways thanks guys thanks so much <coughs> thank you so much for watching this video if you would like to see more from me leave a comment down below because i generally don't know what else i can do on this channel i think i'm sure i'll think of something i need to do a little bit like a bit of a mind map um of stuff to look into and do um to keep this channel going and to keep myself and you guys entertained i do like just sitting here and talking even though i'm really bad at keeping on track with what i'm saying because i seem to just forget everything that i say and then I don't even know. I don't even know. Um, but yeah, it's but just leave a comment if you have any ideas or any tips or any tricks or anything. I still need to educate myself on a lot of on a lot of YouTube tips and tricks. I'm not too sure. But yeah. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs up and possibly subscribe. You know, if you're feeling like you want to make me day please subscribe to my channel because because thank you so much yeah but please i need help so give me criticism don't be mean just give me criticism that's actually gonna be useful to me hopefully i'll see you guys in the next one um so yeah i'm gonna go to work in about five minutes and um yeah thanks guys for watching sorry again if the quality is bad if the lighting's bad if the angle's bad i will get better i promise i pinky promise i actually promise so bad so yeah anyways thanks guys for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it um so yeah bye bye caught